Well done, Lizzie, that's a 200 metre backstroke gold for you. It was just off your British record, but it completes a nice one too with 100. Yeah, definitely. I'm really pleased with my swims this week. And obviously, it would have been nice to sneak under that British record there, but um, to be honest, I'm kind of delighted to be back down in the two minutes. That's, I think, only the second time ever that I've been under a 201, so really, really pleased with that swim. And, you know, hopefully, it bodes well for this, this cycle next year. Your short, cor short course performances suggest that your underwater and your, your power off the wall is quite strong right now. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I've always known it's been one of my strengths, but I think for me it's something that you know I can't get complacent with because the main meets of the year are long course, and you know as, as strong as I might be on my, my walls and underwater and stuff, you know obviously I'm not as good at the, at the swimming part. So it's, it's something I take a lot of confidence from. But as I said to me, I can't get complacent with, and you know the swimming is, the swimming part is equally as important if not more important next year. How deep in heavy training are you at the moment? Have you taken a break at all for this week? Uh, we've taken a little bit of rest. I, um, I raced last week at the uh, Jewel in the Pool in America. Um, went quite a lot faster than that tonight, so uh, it's kind of been a nice progression. But we had to have a little bit of rest for it. But it's nice to swim fast and have a bit of a, a marker kind of midway through the season so that you're not going all the way from September through till trials with no kind of fast swimming. Um, I think a lot, you know, most people here will have had a few days rest and, and we have too. So it's great to be on those, on those times tonight and obviously on Thursday. Um, do back down around my best, really. And as we approach the Olympic trials, obviously the pressure really hikes up, but you're kind of used to that because you've known about it before is it something that you embrace look forward to yeah definitely I think you know trials are always a stressful situation I do think you have to embrace it I do think you have to kind of go with the flow on it and take it one summer at a time one day at a time and just be very prepared when I guess you get to the trial situation that it is a high pressure situation but actually it's no different from any any other meet you know you've got a goal you've got a target time you've got a place to come that's it kind of bottom line really